Hey, there you are. Hey, in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to draw a hand holding a staff. It's perfect for the beginner. My name's Kurt, I'm a dad who draws. Come on, let's get to work. How's everyone doing? My name's Kurt. I'm a dad who draws. So let's go ahead and jump into it. So let's start off with our gesture. And whenever we think of a gesture, gesture, we think of arm. Okay, palm. All right, fingers. Let's see now, that's kind of lining up there. This one's going to come in here. All right. And then the thumb is coming over here. All right, that would be the gesture. Let's look at the tips. Now we're looking for the tips of our fingers. And I'm lining up, lining this up with the top of the arm, because you could see that. Always looking for visual alignments. You see that? So that, that tip is going to line up right there. Next one's going to be, oops. Next tip is going to be about there. Look at this. Those two kind of align. And our last one's going to be back here. As long as I'm here, let's be aware of where the tip of the thumb falls. First tip is going to go there. Okay, next one. To come out. Okay, that's going to be the ring finger, and our pinky is going to be back here. And our thumb, look at that, our thumb is coming way down here. In my, uh, whoa, hey, hey, time out for one quick second. Put your coffee down, drop your pencils, jump down there, subscribe to the channel like the video and let me know if you want to see some videos on maybe uh, feet how to draw feet and shoes just mention it down in the comments okay what type of shoe you would like to draw all right let's get back to work gesture look at look how you know my gesture is just to get the movement that's okay i'm i'm off quite a bit but uh that's you know you always get a starting point all right Next, after our tips, we're going to look at our knuckles. So our knuckles are on the far side of our hand, except um, that knuckle right there, the thumb knuckle. So let's, let's just kind of mark that in relationship to where uh, the tip of that, uh, the tip of our pointer finger is, okay? Next, we're gonna look at our joints. Okay, so this joint is coming way over here, and you know, I, I neglected to, um, this, let's see now, this this is, uh, let's get this pole or the staff in place, okay? I get my straight lines by drawing from my, from my uh, elbow trying to keep that whole forearm straight when you are uh, trying to get a long straight line there. So let's look at our knuckles here. Knuckles, we got the one, all right? Let's move into our joints now. So first, first joint that I see is very obvious is on the middle, the middle finger joint. It's gonna be right there. And you can see that the position of that is going to be a little bit lower than the tips, so let's 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 be wise and and get that in place. So it's it's going to be right about here, a little bit lower. You see that? And then from there we can locate some of the others and make those relationships. So there's that one there, and then the pinky is way out here. Now that that's that's this first that's gonna be these first joints right right along in here. Second back back batch of joints are gonna be right in here. So let's kind of get that in. And it 
that pinky is going to be right about there. Ring fingers there. This, this almost lines up exactly like that. You see that? And the other one is coming in a little bit further like that. Uh, probably like that right there. And we've got the thumb right there. Okay. You know, one of the best things that you could do in order to improve is to draw a little bit every day. I've got this great membership class called the Daily Draw. We get together every day for about 30 minutes. I go live in the afternoon and we cover all things that have to do with drawing. If you stuck with this for three months, I guarantee you, you're going to be far more confident in your drawing. Link is in the description. Check it out. All right, let's get back to work. I think this would lead us into now all of our detail. And if you want to think first of uh, drawing it as a cartoon, hand is what we're looking for. But do, do take note that the thumb is really turning away from us. You see that you see the top of the thumb and the side of it quite, um, quite there in front. So let's, let's make sure that we get that. Let's really think about this coming around here. So there's the, there's the wedge. Okay. And then look out. Look how far back this comes. But it, get, it has that little bit of a miter right there. I'm going to get this middle finger in first. All right, this next guy is coming in. Ring fingers right there. Pinky. And then the pointer. Look at look at this joint right here how it's shifted toward the right. There's a lot more finger back over here you see that I'm gonna definitely push that over a little bit there I use surface lines down here to blow to help turn the corner and point all these things in the right direction. Thumb, nail. And it looks like my pad is a little bit low, so I'm going to shift it ever so slightly and that's going to be my cartoon version so let's just tone in some of these let's add just a little tone in here
Let's get something of a tend in there. Thank you for watching. Feel free to pause this, rewind it, slow it down if you need to. I think there's even a feature in, um, in YouTube that you could slow it down a little bit. Anyways, that's it. My name's Kurt. I'm a dad who draws. Great job out there. Make sure you post these in our Facebook group. Talk to you all later. Have a great day. We will see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. A dad who draws. Hey. You made it to the end. Excellent. Hey, if you're looking for another video on drawing hands, check out this one right here. <laughs> or check out this one right here.